Alright, hello everybody. Welcome back to more Papa Titans mods. Today we have with us Ampliosaurus. And you might be thinking, don't we already have an Ampliosaurus? We do. But that is made by a different modding community. This one was made by the Divine Beast modding community. So let's dive right in. First up, we have our subspecies. This is the balanced subspecies, male. We have our plus defense minus speed. Has a lot more spikes on here. We have our plus speed minus defense, which has a lot of smoother spikes. Our plus attack minus defense, a little bit longer spikes on the shoulders. And we got that bigger forehead up there. Then our double defense and then negative double speed. Right here, he's just a chunkier boy. And then back to balanced. We're gonna check out the female skin right quick. This is our female looks pretty much the same, but this is the female balanced. Female plus defense minus speed. Female plus speed minus defense. Female plus attack minus defense. Female double defense and double negative speed. And then back to balance. All right, let's go through the calls right quick. Here is our broadcast. Uh, he's so tall. I can't fit him all on the screen. I'm so sorry, guys. Here's our two call. It's cute, it's cute. Are threatened. I love the way the tail moves, definitely. I think it could stomp a little bit more. Four call. That one's good, I like that. F call. Very soft, very gentle. Uh, shake him up. Oh, he's a big boy. And I don't know what this one is. Mystery. Oh, let's assert dominance. <laughs> we'll call that the dominance emote. All right, and here's our baby model right quick. It's looking super cute. They got them quick little orange toes there. And here are the emotes. We have our broadcasts. Ooh, okay. Two call. Oh, oh, baby. Threaten. He's having none of it. Four call. Oh, horrible oh, baby. F call. It's cute. Or shake. And then our dominant stance. Ooh, he is all neck. Oh my god. And then we can see the walk for the baby. Ooh, he's fast. Sliding. Now run. Let's see. Does he have a jump? Oh, he does. He has a jump. And a bite. All right, now we're gonna look at all of the animations. The first up is our walk animation. Going uphill and then our run animation. This is a very fast walk. Then we have our sit animation, our sleep. Oh, I put his head right in the bushes where you can't see him, but it's cute. And our get up animation. Then we have our eat animation. Yes, he has the purple mouth coloring from the berries. Precise movement. Our crouch. Our 
crouch walk. Our drink animation. Our swim animation. Very slow, very slow. This is a skin when it is wet. Very shiny, beautiful, very glossy. I love it. All right, and now we're gonna go through the skins right quick. This is the default skin that we have. This is piebald. That's really nice. I like that. Mossback, redneck, articulated, volcano. Ooh, that's so good. Waterfall, Yendel, albino, melanistic, skink, calico, savage, canyon, varied, variegated, variegated, wooden. And that's it. But these are really good. These are some of the best skins I've seen in, in a good hot minute. Let me tell you. Now we're gonna take a look at the abilities. We have our standard bite. A bite attack that deals low damage. Left neck swing. A neck slap that deals medium damage and high knockback. And then we have right neck swing. We're gonna unlock these right quick. Uh, so we'll put them here. We're gonna put the bite here. And then senses, we have acute spikes increases reflex bleed by 50%, which I think is that if you bite them, you take bleed damage. So we have acute spikes. Powerhouse increases damage by 14%, but decreases speed by 3%. Backbone increases stamina by 30%, but decreases sprinting speed by 10%. I won't touch none of those. Front limb, we have right front stomp, a stomp that deals medium damage. And then the same for our left front stomp. We have heavy stomp, which is do a double stomp that deals very high damage unlock that and we'll put this here and right front stomp we're gonna take a look at these uh, metabolism we have picky eater able to only eat flowers the ampio loses weight by 10 percent but gains 15 percent speed while eating and drinking less overall that's new that's definitely new and then we have hefty eater able to eat berries fruits and nuts moderate food drain gorger Able to eat berries, fruits, minerals, nuts, and roots. The sauropod eats faster and conserves 40% more food, but needs to feed more often. The high food intake will decrease thirst rate over time. That's pretty good. I like that one, actually. And we got legs, nothing for legs. Back limb, we have right back stomp, left back stomp, right back kick, and left back kick. A kick that deals high damage and powerful knockback. I'll unlock these. Okay. Then we got tail, right tail attack, deals medium damage but high knockback. And we got left tail attack, deals medium damage but high knockback. And then we have a third slot for the feature. We have a voice ability, rallying roar, a roar that increases armor by 30% to all sauropods. Cannot be stacked. That's fair. I wonder if that means you can waste it at all. All right, and here's all the ability animations. First, we have bite. One more time. Then we have left neck swing. Left front stomp. Right front stomp. Heavy stomp. Woo! One more time. Heavy stomp. Left tail swipe. Right tail swipe. Left back kick. Right back kick. Left back stomp. Right back stomp. And rallying call. All right, I'm super excited for Ampliosaurus, guys. But that's about it for this video. If you like this video, make sure to check out my next video coming out about Torvosaurus and my previous mod videos. 
Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.